I'm gonna tip his bathwater. Do this. Yeah, see, I tricked you, Bowser. <laughs> you think I was going left, but I'm going right. You salty sausage! Hello and welcome back to LP's LP of Super Mario Sunshine. Last episode, we wrapped things up in, well, beyond the village. I mean, we kind of went all over the place, you know, doing the, the eight red coins inside of the secret stages. And that brought our totals, actually, to all of the stages uh, to 10 total shine sprites, counting, of course, the 100 coin shine sprite in each one. Now, as I understand it, there are still yet more shines in each stage. In fact, there is one more. You can see that we have a very nice and even arrangement there of shines. And then, of course, there's more in Delfino Plaza. Maybe maybe the airstrip? Definitely more in, as it relates to, uh, to blue coins. But I think I'm just gonna go this way. Um, I love this game. Don't get me wrong. Arguably my favorite Mario game. But I think it's time to slay Bowser. I think that it's time to kick King Koopa in his King Poopa. You know what I'm saying? We're going to get him and, and make him repent for all of the heinous things that he's done, a.k.a. stolen, you know, Princess Peach again. Uh, I'm going to impale myself on the spikes, perhaps. You know, I'll, yeah. Oh, I just got to get my body ready for the uh, the chomping of Bowser's teeth. That's That was, that was a tactic. A, a mistake? A fail? Oh, no, no, these, these, are, these are just things that I have to do to warm up, clearly. Uh, truth be told, I haven't recorded in a long time, actually. I, uh, <laughs> I took a vacation uh, and, yeah, couldn't record during said vacation. So I am here relearning how to play in some capacity. Isn't it great? Aren't you glad that you can be here for this professional display of impalement? Let's take a second here, real quick. It's very kind of the game to give us a one-up right off the bat. So, you know, if you do as I have done, you can be forgiven in some capacity. Get there. Oh, the spikes are going to come back too soon. No, you spiky Satan. You stay away from me. Uh, nothing over there. And I probably should have jumped already, but it's fine. Fine, we can time it up properly. Right? Cheech Among Us. <laughs> uh, the spikes are... How do I put this? The spikes are evil. I don't like the spikes. The spikes stay away from me! Oh, no. Oh, great. Can we mama? No. I want to, like, mama! Back up onto the platform. Apparently, we are going to be, uh... Dying a lot. And say, it's funny, too. Uh, taking a break. Jiminy Christmas! I gotta... D d put the right friggin' nozzle... On my super soaker here. I'm trying to get too, uh... Not, not fancy with it, but... I'm trying to expedite this process. I'm trying to rush it more than I should. I need to just chill out and take my time with it. It's all fine. It doesn't really matter. I mean, I'm not even in any sort of, like, time budget. Uh, Jiminy friggin' Christmas. All right, I'm, I'm acting like I am under some sort of time budget here. This is ridiculous. I don't understand what's happening. I, I, I swear. I'm... Oh, God! I almost did it again! I don't understand. I'm verbally acknowledging... All of these problems, all of these issues that I'm having, and I am not learning from them. All right, what's the saying? You can you can lead a horse to water, but you can't make it do your taxes. Well, that is reigning true today. All right, because the only taxes I'm paying are the taxes paid to the uh, the pain factory, and goodness gracious, they are charging me an egregious interest rate. It's heinous. Okay, but we're here now, roughly where we perished. Uh, well, not last time, but roughly where we had previously accessed as our farthest location. And if we just take our time, be a good, patient little Palumbo, we can we can doodle this dandy. Beautiful. Just get me over this guy in time to extinguish the flames. Beautiful. And a nice little fountain. Very kind of Bowser to, to give us a, a source of hydration in his chamber of atrocities. And, and more more one-ups. All right, time to commandeer this here dinghy. Uh, it, it's, it's great, again, that he left it here for us, but it's just, well, you know. It's very fragile, okay? If we touch anything with it, it capsizes. I don't understand a whole lot about boating. Frankly, I'm not good with boating. I recently learned that. Gosh darn it, don't touch the things. All right, you're going to get me seasick. I've already done that. We just steer this. Mm, that should be good, right? Mm, not quite, apparently. And I want to get... No, no, no. Let's not go back. 
I'm trying to turn. I don't want to touch the magma wall. I'd very much like to stay the heck away from that, if at all possible. You know, is that, is that in the cards? We're not coming too close to this thing. Okay, we've got room. We're doing fine. Go to the water. The water cries out for Italians, and we are the chosen one that will Italianize the water. It's going to be great, Mario. Mm, mm, mm. You're going to make me grunt like a caveman. You know things are going poorly when you start devolving the evolutionary chain. All right. Let's uh, ne neathanderol. Neathanderolize ourselves this way. Oh! Go that way! <laughs> the boat's about to sink. Rest in peace, Bodie McWeltface. But now we can go up and leave this place. Got the rocket nozzle. Save and continue. Sure. Does that mean that if we died, we were to respawn here? I don't think so, but that would be nice. Up skadoodle. Uh, it's nice of the camera to pan out. Uh, I guess any of these will do. We'll come to the one the right of our screen here. Beautiful. And these moving. They're moving. Mobile clouds. How heinous. I can't believe it. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm. No, that's not correct. I don't... Mm -mm. No. <laughs> ah, the clouds need to move in a way that's agreeable. Please and thank you. Could you be some... What are they doing up there? These clouds are moving. Oh, they're going like in and out. They're alternating. I see. Is very offensive. All right. Those sort of movements are not appreciated by yours truly. But now that I am on this one, it is slightly more predictable. I just have to wait till it's nearly in the center and launch my way through here. Perfect. That one up top looks particularly ominous, meaning it is, but of course, the final cloud. The water's great, hey, Junior? And now we get a look at these dudes be naked. What a reward, right? That's that's the penultimate prize. Uh, Princess Peach. She looked like a doll. That was weird. GameCube, people. It's hardly a... Uh, you know, a powerful machine. Though it was a powerful machine for the time. The GameCube was the last time Nintendo competed on power. In fact. But that was a sight. Anyways, uh, this battle is relatively straightforward. If I do remember, we have to come do big booty bumps on these things. The, uh, the self-prescribed booty bump location. Beautiful. We have sloshed the bathtub. Uh, please do not... Send me into the abyss, all right? I've met with the abyss a few times. The abyss and I do not see eye to eye. I do not see eye to eye either with the guy that likes to fry. Uh, the flames, you see, they do this thing with my body. Uh, there's some sort of chemical reaction. They burn the skin right off of it. It sucks, all right? I'm not a fan. Not a fan. Get up, get up, Mamma Mia, with touching the green bathwater. Now, here's a question I have. Was this bathwater green when they poured it? Like, are they bathing in some sort of, like, green apple juice? Or is it green because of the gross bacteria that's cooking off of their bodies? The truth be told, I believe it's the second one. Oh, you tried to get me there, huh? You bullet bill. I'm gonna bullet kill the dude that's bathing. I'm gonna tip his bathwater. Do this. Yeah, see, I tricked you, Bowser. <laughs> you think I was going left, but I'm going right. You salty sausage. It, oh, 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 let's not, let's not, let's not, let's... Jiminy freaking Christmas. Are we over the top of it? Oh, really? We were on the edge. That wasn't good enough. It's fine, it's fine. We have time now to doodle this dandy the proper way. Don't touch. Oh, God. Oh, boy. Now you're going to blow left? Yep. Ha, ha, ha. You are a predictable Koopa, my friend. I do appreciate you and your 17 brain cells allowing me... Please, no. Please, no. And this is it, right? Is this the end of the battle? Or is there more? I mean, we died, too. Like, the whole thing is like, yeah, you flipped Bowser out of the bathtub. But I'm like 400 feet below him also falling. <laughs> I guess it's a victory. It's a sacrificial victory. Mario, the altruistic animal that he is, sacrificing his own body in an effort to save the princess. <sighs> and still, she won't so much as high-five him. A lot of people ship Mario and Peach. I am mm, friendship for certain. He's dead. He's inhaled six pounds of sand. Princess Peach is bewildered. Flood is getting a tan. 
examining Mario's face. Mario, was I, um, assistance? You were more than of assistance, Flood. You were quite literally the hero. I mean, Mario was just the dude strapped to you. <laughs> like, nothing else could have happened, all right, without Flood. What, are we going to spit on the fire? No, you kidding me? Are we going to pee so hard that we float? Hmm? Maybe after a couple Mountain Dews, but usually no. We're not going to be able to rocket nozzle. We're not going to be able to turbo nozzle. Flood, you were the hero. And the big shine returns. All the piantas begin twerking in front of the Nokis. Who are also twerking. It's a twerk fest 2024, ladies and gentlemen. Isn't it beautiful? Bowser and his chun. His son, his child. Child plus son, his chun. Junior, I've got something. Not invited. Difficult. To the Torque Fest. Princess Peach. I know she's not really my mama. He knows. I mean, it's kind of obvious, but <laughs> he knows. I wanna fight that Mario again. But why? What's your motivation? He just admitted that he knows that the Peach is not his mother, Peach. And he was kidnapping him, and the only reason that Mario was having any sort of conflict with you in the first place is that he wanted to save the princess from the kidnapping. So he's just evil. He's just he's just bad. I guess. Man, that's weird. Like, whatever. People gotta be bad. <laughs> starts now. The vacation starts now, huh, Flood? Oh, look at them partying in Bianco Hills. Isn't it good? Where's Petey? Probably decomposing somewhere in the basement. God rest his soul. Look at them tight roping. It's cute. Mario jumping on top of that Princess Peach's belly. What's happening there? Uh, no, he's jumping on the plane. Maniac. Don't do that. Oh, you're going to break your tailbone. See, that's just what happens. I'm not surprised. The Princess Peach and Flood are hanging out. Isn't that nice? Someone has to wear Flood? or they carry him, or can Flood kind of, like, hobble? Princess Peach is a certified angler, too. Jiminy Christmas. That's a big old fish. You made, like, six, seven sandwiches out of that thing. And Toadsworth, ever the thrill seeker, on the roller coaster. Very good. Well, that does wrap it up. <laughs> I know I toyed around with the idea of 100%ing this, of doing this, that, or the other, and I think that this is actually a fitting, a fitting point to wrap it up. Um, that's just how I like to do these things. These LPs. I LP all over the place as it was put by Astro Void. I like to, you know, I, I play the games that I either love or that I am certain I will love. And they've been highly recommended to me. Much like, you know, Hollow Knight was earlier this year. Um, and Super Mario Sunshine is no different, all right? It's a game that I already knew I loved. It's a game I grew up with. And it was honestly a goal of mine when I started Let's Playing to Let's Play it, but I'd waited this long until I had like the equipment to do it justice or even the ability to do it justice. And I hope I did. I hope that you enjoyed yourself. I really do. There's so many other series you could choose to watch. Somewhat, look at this guy. Super Mario Sunshine 2. Where is it? I require it. Anyways. There's so many other things you could have chosen to do, and you chose to watch this series, and I think that's great. So, with that said, thank you again for doing so. Whether this was your one episode, whether you watched every single episode, whether or not you even finished the episode, you just skipped to the end of this, and this is all you're hearing. I appreciate that. I really hope that you enjoyed yourself, and I hope that I get to see you again for the next one, which will, of course, be starting tomorrow. And it's another game that's near and dear to my heart. Another game I grew up with. Another game that is in my upper pantheon of favorite video games. It is a certain one, Ocarina of Time. So, join me along for that one if you so desire. If not, you know, eat a sandwich, drink some water, and then join me for it. Because, you know, Ocarina of Time is just better when you got a belly full of lunch meat. Anyways, <laughs> I digress. Thanks again for all the people that watched. Thanks again for all the Patreon producers and YouTube members that help support the channel. Thanks again for anyone else who's getting this message. Whether or not you're hearing it, I don't care. It's just amazing that you're getting it. And I hope that I get to see each and every one of you again tomorrow. <laughs>